And the guy in front of me saw me and said, Do you want to come? It's my son's birthday. You want to come? I'm, All right. Why not? That's it. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, Girl, girl. <laughs> The last few days, I've really learned to embrace spontaneity. With the weather the way it is, I've got no choice. But here on the Zamwanga Peninsula, there's always adventure in sight. What's that? I haven't seen that for days. I haven't seen that for like one week. What's going on? Dumingag, the emerald green valley floor, has been a revelation. And before I leave, let's eat. 100 mango trees planted, and they put this here in the middle of it, so let's check it out. It's the first time I've seen a whole chicken in a tonola. That's amazing. <laughs> I love that, that's awesome. I've seen chicken served this way before, though. Is that an egg drop or? <laughs> <laughs> but there is that, I know what you mean. Yeah? The egg drop in a... Yo, egg drop coffee. Remembering your... Uh... Yeah. My childhood Remembering days. your childhood. This is Café Sur Da... Excuse me pronunciation. <laughs> what do you mean? You, how many years in Vietnam? <laughs> <laughs> it's coffee with um, sua is uh, milk and that uh, is ice. But you can fact check that. <laughs> there's, there's a lot of fact checking with you. <laughs> the number of things he's told me, you're gonna have to fact check this. <laughs> it's only this morning because <laughs> he barely had sleep. I'm like... <laughs> Food is a celebration of making the best out of what's around us. We all have to eat, so we should enjoy the process. Oh, I like the chilies. No, I put the devil horns on mine. I just watched a scary movie last night. <laughs> screw up my head. Yeah. <laughs> Nicholas Cage. I was gonna get on the road. However, I checked. There's a big storm coming in, so I'm gonna sit that out because I think it'll be like an hour. The forecast is very, very strange. I don't know, there's rain coming down. I just really don't know what it's doing because it keeps changing the radar. So I'm just going to go for it. I may as well just go for it. It's only rain. Honestly, I should have just gone earlier, straight. It would have been better. <laughs> just the radar looks very threatening and it hasn't pushed. I don't know, it'll probably change back and get me. Murphy's Law. Could be worse. Could be snow. And guess what happened? The rain seems to have gone away and we're coming into some Wonga del Norte, Shayan, which is really, I think, at the heart, has a lot of super cultures heart here. Up and over a short mountain pass, we're coming down to the northern coast. Oh, that's a big river down there. And it's flooding. I love the design of these arches. Very cool. And coming down to Sindangan, I had a decision to make. There's a castle in Sindangan. This is a bustling place, eh? Really bustling. I think it's a Sunday today. And the guy in front of me saw me and said, Do you want to come? It's my son's birthday. You want to come? I'm, All right. Why not? It's a nice old building. Perfect for Ukai Ukai. Sayo ko ka ayo sa kwan. Sa party. Sa And you want to trade in a gaftak too? Okay, this is, I've forgotten the name of it already, the first one. It's like bukayo on the inside and then, yeah, it's like sweet, sweet and coconut and then it's got the glutinous rice on the outside. That's really good. I like that. It's got spots. It's like a panda. Oh, oh, no. you tried this? I've tried that, but lahi in pangalan. 
Dakang ni sa Juan sa Basila nung sa maginto na wala. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. And this one too is really good, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, this one I. Oh, I haven't had this for. Oh, it's so hot, nice. Hmm. Really good. There's no English. <laughs> There's no English. <laughs> Awesome. Only in Sado. Yeah. Yeah. No. Like no. everyone wants to get this one from there. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. So. Oh, now I know. It's our order basis. Yeah. Oh, yeah? It's popular, huh? So, with a couple of hours to spare, we took a walk towards the ocean. It's a famous clan here in Sindangan. Mm -hmm. This this house. Yeah. It's owned by them, but they, they went to the US already, so they sold this. Oh. oh, this area here. Oh, okay. Also, it's a big food. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, no. It's like, it's like oh, yeah. Singapore now. <laughs> Singapore. <laughs> Sindangan po. Sing. Sindangan po. Sindang po. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is cool. Yeah. Yeah. Here, like Singapore, the whole the, it's the cool. food centers, right? Oh, this is nice. This is big. Yeah, oh. Boutique and gift shop. Bebo. <laughs> it's it is, it's bustling, huh? I'm really impressed. I came through here two years ago. It wasn't like this. It was bustling, but this is like good. This is amazing. There's a convenience store. Wow, oh, oh, there's a bar. And it's it's like the oh. owner of that is there in oh, our yeah. home. Oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> the owner of this bar. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, they're they're catering houses too. Nice, huh? Ah, so, so many stands. <laughs> That's so big. Wow. Ah, Buddha fight, Buddha fight in front there. <laughs> and there's really good lechon baka there. Oh, yeah? I don't think they have now because it's... Oh, no. It's really good. Yeah? Especially their sauce. It's what like time do they open here? Um, it's all, it's all, it's open the open. whole day, but mm. sometimes maybe there's no people yet. Ah, okay, now, so. okay. Yeah. Right in front is the ocean. You could go surfing out here. It's very, very, very powerful. Normally, this ocean's not like this at all. They've actually cancelled all the boats going over to Dapi Tan. Typhoons, eh? There's two of them in a row. Plus Habagat being pulled up. Lack of food is no issue today. I found another yellow shirt to change into, so I'll be matching. That was unexpected. I I was going to the ATM, and then I was going to get fuel, and then I was going to decide am I going to stay here or go to Libre. But I was really thinking I was going to go down the road and, and make a bit of tomorrow's journey. Just take an hour off the journey tomorrow, that's fine. And then, while I was at the ATM, it's my son's birthday, do you want to come? Yeah. All right. That was always on. <laughs> yeah, you see, people are good, people are good, and if you trust them, yeah, it can be fine. And they just told me that I can stay here. Nice people, really nice people. Happy birthday! What am I joining? Com Praja. 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 Which means I have to go to Sinulok. <laughs> I'm matching. I'm... That's my sense of humor. Amigo. <laughs> What's your name? Migi. Migi from Sindangan. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. You want to be on my vlog? You want to shout out? If I see myself in the vlog, then I'm gonna be going insane. I will be happy. Yeah, he wants to be in the vlog. I'm gonna sit here. Okay, shiggy, shiggy. So it will be one of the what says in your vlog. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> see, Ivana. Ivana, oh, Ivana. <laughs> Hello. Oh, <laughs> 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 <
Bye bye. Smells like girl. Girl girl. I don't know where to go. Sticker rice and then the brown sugar, the masubado. And then what kind of? Lami bye bye. Bye bye. Lami bye bye. Lami bye bye. Lami ayo. Lami girl girl. Kinsang dila ani? Okay ka ayo. This is the first time I've ever seen tiny pizzas. Siggy? Well, na ba yun? Kaya ba yun? Kaya ba yun? You will go ano ba yun early? Kaya ba yun? Hindi ko ka mabutaw. And I took their advice because I really did have somewhere to be the next day. My hosts have a gas station, so I'm also gonna buy some fuel. Salamat ka ayo. Good morning. Bye 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 bye. Bye bye. Oi, na manani. <laughs> Still the morning, no more of that. <laughs> really nice guys just saw me there. Do you want to come to my son's birthday? All right, okay, why not? <laughs> and always so fun. So today, yesterday was a birthday party. Today is apparently it's a Muslim holiday. I've forgotten which one. And some of the places I'm going to go through are majority Muslim, so there might be a celebration. I don't know much about them. It's a route along the north coast of the Zamboanga Peninsula that's only recently been completed. So there was a section of this that used to be very difficult. So let's check out some of these towns along here. Let's go to Liloy first. I've taken this road before. Last trip I used my truck when I saw diesel at 100 per litre. We're really driving along the ocean already. This is on the North Coast Road and I can check on the weather fairly easily, I think. <laughs> you see it in the distance there. Speaking of weather, because I love doing weather reports, which would be an alternative career. It rained very, very, very heavily last night. We're in between this typhoon and the next typhoon, so the tail of both. And, oh yes, this is Liloy. I need to turn here, I think. I don't know what's gonna come in or not because it's constantly changing. If it rains, I have a rain jacket and this road is, from what I can see, fairly good. It's on the road sign. Oh, okay, let's put my raincoat on. Sorry, I've hardly filmed anything for the last hour. It's just been me getting soaked. <laughs> but at this stage, I saw it on the map. It seemed to be moving this way. There's just a, let's see, a couple of hours perhaps of that. But there's people going this way, so I guess it's all right. If it's really, really heavy, I just have to take this helmet cam off because if I don't, the connection is USB-C between my microphone and the camera. If there's too much rain, then water gets in there and destroys it, so... Let's see what we can do. <laughs> Hello. Which is exactly what happened somewhere up here. Incredible, really incredible. I hope the road's okay all the way. <laughs> so I just attached a different camera to my helmet, but it doesn't have a microphone connection. So I'll voice over instead. The beauty of the forest that I was climbing into. The next few kilometers were good gravel, but then the concrete returned for a while. This last 20 kilometers to Baligian is what's called Putol Putol. Still under construction. Sometimes 
you have to ride off-road. But at least it means there's always equipment on standby for the inevitable. I saw plenty of motorbikes, even small scooters, traversing this route as it alternated between concrete and gravel. This was the only challenging section, a steep, muddy downhill. But soon enough, the road was solid again. Whatever the weather, it's always special to ride through the forest. Okay, we're at kilometre two. The last 20 or so kilometres have not been complete, but I wouldn't say difficult. I've seen scooters, I've seen Mios, Fazios, M-Maxes, many M-Maxes going up through here. It's not, it's, it's okay, it's okay. That's actually, you can't actually avoid all risks in life. You manage them and that's a good example. I can see, one, I can see the surface is okay, it's rocky. Two, I can see others going on well, motorbikes with that are less set up for off-road than me and I can see lots of construction equipment around and they're fixing stuff that slides so I think that might be the difficult bit out of the way it's a shame because this forest is beautiful there's so many like waterfalls beside the road there's one time I had to cross one there's just forest this is always amazing always 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 amazing so Let's go down to Badigua. I'm, I'm hungry now, so let's go eat something. <laughs> but in the end, I continued to shock on, figuring it was larger. I got lost in what felt like Tausug communities, but the market can always be relied on for good caverned areas. Oh, manoksha. Chicken. Chicken. And uh, no, nanka. Nanka. Dabo. Uh, Dabo. Uh, When you're wet already, you may as well just push on. I'm trying to be optimistic. <laughs> this is the thing, I'm trying to be optimistic. <sighs> I've left shock on. I, I'm i forever wanting to do more. It's, I could hear a lot of Tausug there. I think that's the majority here, and especially on, on this side, because it faces that way. It's rain. <laughs> so, this rain, I don't care. I can ride through it. The problem is trying to make content when it's raining is next to impossible. This is now the eighth day, I think, of this. It's the third typhoon or low pressure in a row, which is which happens, but it's unusual. Hopefully, hopefully, if I get to Zamwanga City, hopefully this will be the last. I really hope so. The road actually goes all the way around from Sibuko around the western side of into Zamwanga. I wanted to take all of it. I don't think I am, because it's pointless. <laughs> I. I, I can't possibly do it any kind of justice unless something drastically changes, which I don't think it will. I'm just going to go straight. I'll find Tiori Itum. Oh. <laughs> so I followed that original plan. The issue is that the old main road from Sirawe to the highway all looks like this. Oh, <laughs> Actually, the fact that it's rough road is purely, purely academic. I can always take this on the rough road. There's no issue at all. It's just when I look at it and then I look at this, I may as well just stick to my original plan. I'd rather be on here if it rains. Let's see, Rawai. And that, I think, they're trying to make something that looks like a boat. Okay. Right now it's... Oh, maybe a palenque. The 
blues, the blues of the water are awesome, awesome, awesome. <laughs> These guys love the drone. Everyone loves the drone. That, this is steep. <laughs> Into the abyss. Waterfalls deep inside the forested valleys incredible engineering and then finding yourself in the valley yourself just absolutely incredible the mountains here Welcome to Sibuko. Buko is very realistic. But with the time and the weather, I didn't want to risk staying too long. I'll be back for sure. I'm somewhere in Labuan. Labuan is, I think, the first barangay of Zamboanga City. We know it's Zamboanga City because they're are an unnecessary large number of KCC adverts. They are everywhere. If Lanau del Sur enthrones sultans, Zamwanga City enthrones KCC. <laughs> that was... Uh brilliant moment. <laughs> Kite to flow. Yeah, yeah, you, you wanted to take a motorbike, right? Yeah, I wanted to take the motorbike and then I saw this and then I said, oh, it's good that we walked. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Turns out all those tarps were effective subliminal advertising. Yes. It's a celebration. <laughs> I don't know what of. It's a set I've made, I was craving, I saw this at seven o'clock this morning and I said it's too early. It's happening. Yep. Five hours later. <laughs> oh, yeah, someone told me this is very good and it's got cool muscle so it must be healthy. I like how this has been just put in front of me. There's a lot of beef in there as well, which I like. Your type soup, you like spice I think. I hope so anyway. <laughs> and, that's yours. Oh, that was mine? Yeah, that's yours. That was first, always. <laughs> So serious when it's doing awesome. this. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> it's awesome. Black and coconut with some other spices I forgot. I haven't coughed yet. Amazing. I'm getting used to it. I've got to ask you though, when was the last time you had Tiori Um, uh, Me? Yeah. I don't remember exactly when. It's been, it's been a while. Okay, perfect, perfect time. You know what? <laughs> I just have it because I'm craving it. It's meant for occasions. <laughs> craving is an occasion. Well, let me try this one. Oh, okay. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Nice meeting you, huh? Oh. <laughs> okay, met, met. Huh? It's hot? Not that hot. <laughs> that's, that's the blood. Okay, I'm gonna try. You sure? No. That's, that's, that's also way of eating chili. Oh, it's not that hot. <laughs> Bell pepper. At, at the beginning. <laughs> and the seeds are now in my <laughs> influencing me. No, you eat too much. <laughs> I'm just going to swallow it straight so I don't bite <laughs> on the seeds. I'm oh, breathing fire now. Yeah. Oops. The best thing about walking is you can take a trike when it rains. Let's see how long this lasts for. 